Alright coin hunters, I thought I'd be real quick and concise with this video so I went ahead and just poured the um, large round that we did the other day. It was 458.3 grams. Um, we were able to get three, or I mean five, three ounce um, pours. They're not exactly three ounces, this one's a little over. These two are pretty exact three ounces. These two are slightly light. Um, so. That's what's going on here. And uh, so we'll go ahead and just take a look. I thought it came out pretty well. Um, the lines on the uh, mold were very fine, so not a lot of uh, the detail in the hat got captured. This one turned out the best. This is the middle pour. This is going from uh, weighs the most to weighs the least, and I think this is actually the order I poured it in, too. Uh, this one was definitely first. It was it was a pretty heavy pour. I I knew it when I poured it. I was like, oh man, it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty heavy. Um, but a nice uh, nice thick round here, just to get ready for the summer. We have different types of pours for the three D printer. Let's go ahead and throw this on the scale. Hopefully, you guys can see it all right. in troy ounces so that's 3.29 troy ounces so slightly heavy these two are pretty spot on 3.05 troy ounces pretty nice there oh, straighten that out again this one is 3.02 troy ounces this one is slightly light 2. Point 6.2 troy ounces This one I think is the lightest yep 2.56 troy ounces So relatively consistent not the most consistent, but you know you got a rough Three ounce pour two and a half ounce pours. I think they they feel really good in the hand nice and hefty and uh, a pretty cool design got the uh, the pirate doubloons <laughs> if you want to call them that but I thought it was pretty cool and uh, you know just something to share with you guys and uh, if you guys want more videos like this go ahead and drop a like subscribe if you haven't and drop down in the comment section if you pour silver do you want to pour silver um, you know just add to the conversation I will be making a video probably later today or tomorrow adding to the conversation there's been a few youtubers talking about is precious metals an investment or is it a hedge against inflation? It's a pretty hot topic and I'm going to touch base on it later today and be posting the video later on this week.